Hi everybody, so today this video is just going to be a little haul. Um, just literally got back from Birmingham, um, went to see Matt Cardle last night and had lots of fun but I am really really tired. Um, this morning before heading home went into the bull ring to have a look around and yeah bought a few things so I will show you what I got from uh, HMV. Don't like giving them money anymore. Um, I got this which is uh, Abraham Lincoln Vampire Hunter. Uh, I went to see this at the cinema and I absolutely loved it. Um, so yeah I got the Blu-ray. Dominic Cooper in this looks just divine. So yeah I'm gonna watch that tonight I think. From Debenhams I got this little gift set. Um, it is the Lancome Hypnose Drama Mascara. Um, I've got the Hypnose Star um, Mascara in a sample and I really really like the formula. So yes, I got this one. They didn't have any gift sets of the Hypnose Star but they had this one which was the mascara on its own is supposed to be 21 quid um, but in this it's 21 pound and you get the um, makeup remover and the eyeshadow, eyeshadow, eyeliner pencil as well included. Uh, it's in this quite fancy sort of glittery packaging as well which is quite cute. And there you go. Um, I'll try and take out the actual mascara to show you the wand. So this is the mascara itself and there's the wand. Um, it's very very different to the Hypnose Star one but I'm hoping this is just as good because I'm assuming it's the same formula just a different wand. Um, so yeah that is the Hypnose Drama gift set. So if you are on the lookout for a Lancome, a Lancome mascara you're probably best off getting the sets. I thought that these would be a lot more expensive but they're the same price so okay. And from Boots they had loads of new nail polishes in that I've been wanting and yeah I kind of went a bit crazy. So I got So I got three Model Zone nail varnishes and I got three Barry M ones. Um, they were all on three for two so you get one free. Um, so I got three from the, uh, I think it's called Wonderland collection of the Model Zone ones and these are the glittery ones from Barry M, the new ones. So I'll show you the Model Zone ones first. This one it's called Jack Frost and it is a absolutely gorgeous glitter which is like white but it's got like the teal glitter in there as well absolutely beautiful then there's this one which is a little bit similar this one's called snowflakes now, this one's mainly got like the amber yellowy sort of tones in it um and this one's like um not normal glitter it's like hexagonal glitter and you know the jaggedy sort of glitter. Can't wait to try that one. That one's probably the one that I really want to try the most. Um, and then I also got this one which is called Northern Lights. This is a sort of pinky colour but it's got all these different beautiful glitter pieces in. It's very very finely milled glitter so I'm gonna have lots of fun playing around with that. Then onto the Barry M ones. I can't remember what this collection's called, but any glitter polishes I'm pretty much sold on. <laughs> They're a hell to get off the nails, but absolutely love them. So this one's called Diamond Glitter. And as you can see, it's small pieces and big pieces of all these 3D glitter. Reminds me quite a lot of Max 3D glitter, um, which I loved. Um, then, then we have this one which is called Rose Quartz Glitter. As you can see this one is sort of a rosy tone to it. It's got blues, greens, pinks, reds, 
and again it's sort of big glitter and little glitter as well which is very nice and finally this one is called pink sapphire glitter this one's probably the most interesting of the lot because um, you've got the big big glitter, the little glitter and you've got the sort of long pieces of glitter as well sorry if I'm not making any sense I'm seriously deprived of sleep um, not that I make much sense anyway but you know so yeah this one's really pretty as well then from Forever 21 first time ever going in Forever 21 was quite disappointed they didn't have any of the plus size ranging which I was really looking forward to looking at but they didn't have any don't understand why uh, but I did get a pretty necklace from Forever 21 this was £4.90 and I just really fell in love with it I think it's beautiful like it quite a lot and it's a really nice wearable size as well I think so it's good and finally from TK Maxx I went in to see if they had any of the Urban Decay items that I've seen people talk about um, but the one at Birmingham Bull Ring didn't have any so I was gutted but I did find a couple of things that I love so <laughs> I got some David and Goliath socks these are so cute um, probably not going to be able to see them that well because it's covered by this uh, but you get three pairs of socks all with the same design but in different colours uh, these should be £15 they were 4 99 for three pairs so I think that's pretty good finally we have this which is another Betsy Johnson purse and I absolutely love the one that I've got now um, but I looked at this one and fell absolutely in love with it and it comes with a box as well my other one didn't come with a box so yeah same price as my last one it's 12 99 um, and it's attached to it randomly throw the box down there for a sec um, I don't know what's going on here but it's this weird I don't know what material you'd call this it's weird anyway um, it's pretty much identical inside to the other one um, I just really like this sort of I don't know what to call it, it's a royal blue but it's this odd material I'm really quite liking and it says Betsy Johnson on there so yeah really like this a lot so yeah so that's everything I got from Birmingham um, an old haul video will have probably uploaded before this one um, and I've got a Ron Wee haul as well which I'm not sure what order these are going up in it depends when I eventually edit them and when I've got time to upload them um, so yeah that's it thank you for watching and I'll see you all again very soon adios